hi guys hope you're doing well and your day has been has been good uh, and for those who are waking up your night has been so restful and now you are ready to start off the day so today is on uh, it's on tuesday evening and uh i decided just to reintroduce myself i think most of the guys some uh, most of the guys know what i do and some of them don't know what I do. Myself, I'm a real estate agent who is located in Kilimani, Lovington, Kilelesho, Mutaiga, Westland, Serunja, Gigiri, Kitusuru, all those places where you are thinking of buying property, investing a property, or even letting out a property. Um, so that's what I do. I also I'm also a Airbnb host and uh, mostly I host in Kilimani, yeah, Kilimani and uh, I'm still trying to think of other areas that I venture in the near future. So that's another thing that I do. They are all, the, being a host and being a, being a host and being a, being a host and being a real estate agent, those are my full-time job. Then I have another job that uh, just very few people know. I do, I sell some uh, phone accessories and beauty products. My shop is located in one of the small towns in Nairobi. Yeah, I'll disclose it as time go by. The reason why I said I should, uh, I should reintroduce myself uh, so that at least you can know what I do. And in case you have someone who is looking for whatever I'm doing, you can always refer me and uh, you can always uh, reach me anytime any day because uh, I know my work sometime it's 24 or 7 from Monday to Saturday and anytime that you need to meet to reach me you can always call me uh, do a text or do a whatsapp or even do an email I'll be able to respond to your question and I'll be able to assist to assist where I can. Um, today was just another good day. It started well, and although I was a bit sleepy in the morning, I usually wake up 5 a.m. in the morning. After waking up, what I do, I pray, I journal, I read my Bible, and I do my gratitude, gratitude, gratitude journal. I do that, and then after that, I read some maybe a, a chapter. Or some pages for a chapter or some pages for the book that uh, I'm reading currently I'm reading currently I am reading the psychology of money and uh, I'm in chapter two um, I'm, 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 I'm ready to explore it and see how it goes and then from there I usually go to the office have my breakfast and then go to the field source the property so today it was one of these days that i didn't go to the property i didn't go to the i just went to the office and um because i had a guest i remember yesterday i mentioned that this there's a guest who booked my property my apartment uh for the next three days so no for the next five days so i was so ready and i was waiting for the client to come and check them uh when i Got in the office, my girl called me and she told me that she cannot be able to open the door. Those doors, they are very funny because if you leave the key inside the lock, it won't be able to open even if you have a spare key. So I called the lady. She's also a host from the apartment where, from the apartment where I have a, a Airbnb. And she told me the guest has already forgotten the, the key. And... Uh, I got panicked. You can imagine you have a guest who is checking in at 10 and the guest is direct from Airbnb with just a working client. You can try to see how you're going to work with them. But now for Airbnb, it's the most sensitive, the most sensitive link that you ever get the client from. Because this is an app whereby once you get host, once you get, once you host, when the guest check out, they are able to to write their review and it's going to remain that wall and you yourself you're going to do a review which is going to remain on that wall 
so now I was I, 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 the reason I was so tense and scared because I can't open my door. The guest is calling me. They are already there. They are almost there. So I had to come out of my from my office to the apartment to make sure that they are. Uh, like uh, to make sure that everything is okay but when i went there still the same problem so we were all stranded but thank god another guy from the apartment was, was able to help us and um we manage we managed that uh, we wanted to open the the apartment and we started cleaning and the guest was good i'm just hoping by the time he's going to leave the country he will give me a bad review <laughs> Because I'm a super host, by the way. Yes, I'm a super host. Yeah, I'm a super host. And I, uh, I can't imagine going below what I am. I think I'm 4.5 stars, yeah? So I can't imagine going below than that. Because already I've really worked hard, to be honest. Before you get those four stars and before you become a super host. I think I've, I've been a super host for the four consecutive times. So... I can only imagine uh, getting those stars again. Uh, it's not easy to be honest. It's not for those who are on BNB, they can they can tell you. Yeah, so that has been my day. Then I left the office. I, okay, we settled the client well, and I came back to the house and made a made I made the guy and uh, some domas for breakfast. So right now. I'm supposed to, uh, uh, in the next minute after this video, I'm going to sleep. Yeah, so that I can have energy for waking up tomorrow and to go to work. So guys, that's all I have for today. And um, I love you guys. Continue subscribing, continue commenting, continue sharing your view. <coughs> your view. Continue suggesting what we should do often. And then and know that I love you and remember that you're grateful for greatness.